Hello, I just got back from a mushroom excursion in uh, in the Swedish woods, and uh, me and my brother were out for like uh, one hour, and uh, we got this two bags full of mushrooms, edible ones, many of them are, uh, you know, like five stars in the Mycologist Bible, meaning that they are uh, supposedly delicious. We got them in one hour and it's about 10 pounds, I would say. A lot of these mushrooms catch high prices in uh, the delicatessen stores, you know, and I mean to show you some of them. Uh, this little yellow fellow here, uh, yellowy one, is kind of peppery and um, it's a very good for um, omelets and uh, that kind of stuff. You. Uh, you take down the pepperiness by uh, using uh, uh, garlic salt, for instance, in an omelette, and it's uh, very delicious. <laughs> then we have this little cocky fellow. Cocky fellow. Looks rather like my dick, by the way, but it's bigger. The, mar <laughs> the mushroom, I mean. The, this uh, variety was um, uh, imported from France in the beginning of the 19th century. Looks like this. It's the uh, same time Sweden imported its, its king, by the way, 200 years ago. These mushrooms catch a price of like, uh, like 20. Twenty dollars a pound, and I could easily, you know, pick like uh, forty pounds of these in a working day, I guess. <clears throat> so, but you can't live that way anyway because the mushroom season only lasts for a couple of weeks. Now, this mushroom is uh, this red one. I don't know. Yeah, now you can see that it's red. This one is a poisonous mushroom, red with little white dots on it, and uh, but what was used uh, by the Vikings for, um, you know, before battle they used to eat stuff like this to get into the famous berserk rage that made them very courageous. So I guess it means it, it, it gets you kind of high. I've never tried it though. It is poisonous, you know, and I suggest no one else tries it either. <clears throat> so, um, in an hour, my brother and I found about uh, 10 different varieties. I can only show you like four or five here in this limited time. <laughs> I've I already showed you a little cocky fellow. The French one, the little cocky French one. Now I'm going to show you a, a huge titty one. See this one? That's a huge titty. No, it's also rated five stars in the Mycologist Bible. You want to see it once more? Huge titty. Remember this one. It's very good. It's very good. You fry it whole in, in olive oil and it's uh, just delicious. Salt and pepper, pepper should be added though. Now, this was my first lesson in mycology from Sweden. I suggest you do not go out on your own and pick mushrooms though, unless you, you have a mushroom coach with you because it can actually be, you know, lethal. There are, like in Sweden, 
three or four varieties of mushrooms that you actually die from a very small quantity if you eat it. So please don't even try it on your own. That was all from Sweden now for this time. Okay, bye.